he was a gym goer and having a lot of muscles, mashallah, tabarak Allah. And I will never forget that brother because he was exceptionally tall. And he came to me after one week of his marriage, claiming that he tried to have intimacy with his wife, only to find out that he couldn't at all for a whole week. And when I chat with him about his practices online, I got to know that he was addicted for too long to pornography. And as a result, he couldn't function on his wedding night. And this is, by the way, it's not uncommon at all. Pornography conditioned your brain to seek sexual pleasure through screens and pixels only. And as a result of this, this is now one of the most common things that have been happening since 2006, specifically with the rise of YouTube-like videos, the streaming videos online. With more accessible image of that nature, your brain will be overstimulated with these images. And as a result, many reports, many people have reported that they can't function sexually with their real life partners. Erectile dysfunction. At a, a very young age, as young as 18, there are research in Italy, in Sweden, in America, where actually they have found that the rise of erectile dysfunction among youth, youngsters, below the age of 40 have increased by 30% within 10 years span of time. Erectile dysfunction. So you watch pornography, you have no problem with erection, you have no problem with ejaculation, but when it comes to real life partner, you can't function. And the reason is your brain had conditioned you to seek that pleasure and to attain that pleasure through screens, through pixels, through images only. This is known now, a condition known as porn-induced erectile dysfunction. Dr. Carlo Foresta, the head of the Italian Society of Andrology and Sexual Medicine, he stated, it starts with lower reaction to porn site, then there is a general drop of libido, and in the end, it becomes nearly impossible to have erection. So imagine yourself in that position. If you're unmarried and you're planning, inshallah, to, to get married in the land, to make it halal, imagine yourself in that position. Would you like to actually look at your wives in the eye and tell her, sorry, even sorry, I, I can't do anything about it. Wallahi, my brothers and sisters, just two days ago, I witnessed a divorce case because of this same issue. Erectile dysfunction. For how long? Two years. Wallahi, the brother told me, and the, and the sister too. Two years, the, he couldn't function sexually. But when he's on porn, you don't have a problem with erection and masturbation. May Allah protect us all. We get a lot of reports where a husband will beat up his wife during sexual intimacy. Why is that? How did he learn these things? From pornography. We get other reports, even more horrific news about a husband who will handcuff his wife and try to uh, simulate rape scenes that he had seen in pornography, in porn films. And as a result, all, all of that lead to something even more massive, and that is disliking the halal relationships. SubhanAllah. When you desire the haram, my brothers and sisters in Islam, what happens? You lose interest in the halal. So, so many people will leave their wives and hunt for prostitution houses, dirty massage places, as a result of what? The escalation of the addiction in the brain. I think that's sufficient reasons for you, my brothers and sisters, to quit watching this film.